Okay, so now what we have done, this is for two paths. So for example, if you will need to do a four paths. So right now, what do we need to do? Uh, again, we are going to change the parameter. Uh, so over here, this is the parameter for channel A. The diameter is the same. Thickness is the same. And material is also the same. Uh, no lining. Roughness is the same. Water. Uh, temperature here still remains. And then next, what we will do at the measurement. Okay, so remember this is a channel A. Uh. Okay, measurement point number. Actually, this is for us to, if you want to do any logging, uh, then that, that's a point. Uh, this is the sound path. So, if we're going to do four sound path, uh, so it will actually take a longer distance because then from the transducer, it will send one, two, three, four. Uh, so that's why the distance is longer. So here it says, 204 okay so let's uh, look over here uh, here the ruler only until 140 150 uh, so if i want 204 all that i need to do loosen it you shift okay i uh, remember is the edge here uh. so this is 100 then the other side i'll change 204 mm okay so right now i take it as my coupling coupling gel is enough huh? so let's check whether is it okay or not okay so you come back to the transmitter after you have already adjusted your distance ah, okay so over here how do we know whether this is this setup is fine uh, again you look at the signal uh, this is a high enough signal LED channel is green then we will be able to start so say for example we still take it as a 204 okay Okay, uh, successfully set up. So in this case, again, uh, there's no flow, zero meter cube hour, green LED, uh, you are able to do the measurement already. Yeah, so this is how you will do your mounting of the trans transducer, setup of your transmitter, you're good to go. Okay, good, thank you.